Temps this low, it can get unbearable outside and it's also very dangerous. That's why some schools are working to keep students safe. Shannon Kantner reports. Kids usually can't wait for recess and winter weather. Sledding, building snow winds. But for now, snowmen are being built inside at Wacusta Elementary. It's the cold temperatures that we cannot take them outside, and it makes it really difficult because these kids at this age need some time to run off some energy, need a break from the schoolwork. So like many schools, it's inside recess until it gets a little warmer. Play games, uh, Lego contests for sit-ups and push-ups just to work off some energy. He admits the kids are getting a little stir-crazy, but parents are happy with the decision and glad to help, offering extra supervision, making sure kids bundle up, and answering tough questions. When they get off the bus, that's the first thing. Are we going to be outside for recess today? <laughs> Which kind of breaks your heart a little bit, but you know it's better for them to stay inside. While the kids and probably adults are counting down the days until they can get back out here and have some fun, other people have no choice but to be out in these conditions, and they're just doing their best to stay safe and stay warm. The cold can take your breath away. Bob Poig works for CS Roofing, and these extreme temperatures might slow down work, but it rarely stops. Like working in the heat, you've got to know your limitations. Once your fingers and toes start getting cold, you got to go down, sit in the truck, warm up a little bit, get back out and continue to do what you're doing. He always carries extra gloves and socks, and while the beard keeps him warm, there is one drawback. It actually forms ice crystals. Not something the kids have to worry about, but they come prepared. Snow pants, boots, coat, hat, gloves. Just in case it's not inside recess. In Grand Ledge, Shannon Kantner, Fox 47 News. Another thing the schools are doing is changing the times for those bus routes. That way the kids don't have to wait outside in the cold.